hey guys welcome to the video how are you guys doing if you're new hey do not forget to smash that subscribe button and if you're a returning subscriber mwah, thank you so much for coming back i really really appreciate it oh my god guys it's a book oh okay okay so i told you guys i'm on the book buying limit yes i think from january to so from January to June, I'm supposed to have bought like 10 books. So let's see if I'm still on track because I feel like I've, I think I've finished buying the 10 books already and we're still in April, May. We're going to May already. Yeah. Anyway, so I'm so excited. These books I've been waiting for. I paid for some of them since January and I've been waiting for them anyway. Anyway, long story short, the books are here. Yes. These three books just came today like right now and i'm excited so i unboxed it for instagram so you guys must have already seen it but yeah the first one is bride by ali Azawood. everyone else has read it it's like a omega verse or metaverse i'm not sure but they all say it's really some it's a miss it or miss you know some people like it some people don't but i'm a fan of ali Azawood, so i had to just get this i think i have almost all our books but not really everything you know but I have quite a number of our books, so I can't wait to get into this one. Oh my god, the cover is very pretty. It's a romance between a werewolf and a vampire-ish. Then I got... Oh my god, I've been waiting for these books. <laughs> Jeez. Divine Rivals and Ruthless Vows. The number of things I've heard on this book, <laughs> it passed something else. Um, I think they are rivals. And they mistakenly were writing letters to... No, she was writing magic letters and they were going to him. And he was responding, but she thought it was her brother, you know? That kind of vibe. And this is the book too. Honestly, these covers are to die for. <laughs> they are absolutely cute. I don't know what else to say. <sighs> oh, she has freckles. This one says, no God, no war. No one can come between them. Wow. This one says... Turn apart by war, reunited by love. <laughs> two rivals, two stories, two hearts, one fate. Two hearts, two journeys, two choices, one destiny. Okay, okay. <sighs> then, these books I want to show you guys were sent to me by the author herself. Adesua Oman Umokedi. So these are the three books. I added this to my previous haul, but somehow I think I lost the footage, so I have to show it again. Yes. So this one is Any Love, but um, it's a spin-off from one of our series, the Ginica, Ginica's Bridesmaids. And then uh, Whatever It Takes. This one is very popular. A lot of people have, have read this, except me, of course. And this one is The Marriage Class. I just finished reading this, like, yesterday night. I just finished it and I loved it. I gave it a five star, guys. I tapped the heck out of this book. I wrote everything I can ever think of in this book. I love it so much. Not only did she send them to me, she also, you know, like, signed and then she was like, Hi, hey, Gracie, uh, you're awesome. And she, just, and she said, oh, okay, oh, okay. At this point, I'm telling Robbie before, this one comes with this uh, bookmark. It's so cute. Honestly, I enjoyed reading this book. I can't wait to even get into this, but this is not the beginning of this series. So I have to, like, go and get the books to read them from the beginning because I like to follow it in order, you know. So thank you so much, Adesua, for sending me these lovely books. I'm so excited. Like... <sighs> okay. So I went to Lagos in March with Babe and of course I had to visit the bookstore. Of course I had to enter Wida. So I got these two books. The People in the Trees by Hanya Yanahira. I've read A Little Life by her and it was yeah traumatic a traumatic kind of book but I didn't cry like people said I would cry. So I don't even know what to expect from this one because I've never even seen it anywhere. It was my first time and I was like okay oh my god whoa 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 look at the font what is wrong with her books and the fonts? Why are the fonts so tiny? This one, is, I even bought it because I was like, oh, it's tiny, it's small in size compared to A Little Life. Let me go and read it ASAP. But look at the font. I didn't even open the book. Okay, so I don't know what it's about, but I'll figure it out when I start to read. Then the second book I got at Wida is This Girl by Colin Hoover. I already have this girl. 
but i wanted to co complete the butterfly because there are three books and they complete a butterfly so i had to and and the, this let me just show you guys because i feel like i'm saying rubbish so this is the copy of this girl that i had uh, i didn't even know it was a like a trilogy thing can you see that the cover is different but look at the other books slammed point of retreat then this girl would complete it do you see the butterfly even though i'm not holding it correctly so that's why i got this cover so i'm going to be doing something with this the other cover it's not like i don't like the cover it's just that i wanted it to match and i've been looking for it everywhere so when i found it at wida i was like oh you ain't going away from me you know and it was really cheap there so i bought it i bought if it had been no if i if only I had told her by Laura Nolan. I read if you had been with me last month, I think in February. I, I don't remember. It was sad. I cried a little, but not much. So I heard that this one is in the POV of the boy. So um, I'm actually curious to see what's going to happen. Yes. Then my friend Promise. You guys know Promise by now because I've been mentioning her name almost every single video that I've posted. She gave me a lot of books in my last book haul, like a lot of books. So she gave me this book two of these two twisted crowns and I didn't have the book one and I was looking for it everywhere. I could not get it. So she gave me the book one also. Imagine. Thank you so much, Promise. I really, really appreciate it. So One Dark Window by Gillian Gill. People say it's like Dark Academia, fantasy-ish vibes and... It has actually been gaining a lot of hype on book two, book talk, and everywhere. So yes, oh guys, guys, guys. So the other day, I received a book package, and I was not even sure who it came from. I was like, I was lost because I didn't buy books. You know, I'm trying to be on a book buying ban limit, limit not ban. And I received these two books. This one is Josh plus Hazel's Guide to Not Dating. By Christina Lauren. Christina Lauren, I love their books. And this one is The Wall of Winnipeg and Me by Mariana Zapata. I've not read any of her books before, but I have like quite a lot of her books already. And she's a queen of slow born, according to what I heard. So me opening this package, these books, and then seeing something that made me realize that it was my boyfriend that bought it for me. So I was so happy. You need to see the video on Instagram because I posted, you know, I, I like unboxing on Instagram. So I posted it and it, if you want to watch it, I'll just, I'm, I think I'll put the link down in this video so you can actually easily just watch it and see how my reaction was and everything. It was so cute. I felt like, oh my God, so this is love. Ooh. So, wait. Yeah, so these two books, I remember. <laughs> Guys, I went to the pharmacy to buy my skincare like I normally do in Med Plus. Then I saw they had some books, so I bought. I don't know why they sell books in a pharmacy store because every single time I enter that pharmacy store, I always buy books. Always, unfailingly. Anyway, I got this one Blessings uh, by Chukwe Buka eBay. Uh, my friend read it and she gave it a very, very high rating, 4.5. So I was like, okay, curious. I'm going to read it. But it, the cover is not my best cover ever. But yeah. And I think it's like a sad book because this guy just looks sad for no reason. I don't know, but I'm excited though. Then I also got Ogadima. This is a very, very popular book. I was not really in love with the cover of the previous ones I've been seeing. Like the same book, but their covers, I didn't really like it. So when I saw this cover, I, I fell in love and I was like, okay, okay, I think it's now high time for me to buy it. So I bought it. And I've, as, from everything I've heard, everybody says that this book is a sad book, but that's not new for Nigerian authors. Most Nigerian authors write sad book that you just be so angry because of all the suffering anyway that's besides the point i'm so excited to get into it anyway <laughs> you know we all love sad books right so guys that's all those are all the books i have there are 14 books and i was gifted six out of them so i think that's pretty good yes <laughs> doesn't matter because I, I think i've exceeded the number of books i'm supposed to buy from now till uh, you know so anyway it doesn't matter doesn't matter but i should say this i feel like i have done really good because this time last year i bought over 100 books by now i have bought 100 so it's crazy that right now I've, 
I'm just maybe a little bit over 10 or maybe not so much. Do, do, do you understand me? Anyway, anyway. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button and deuces. Uh, out of mm, mm, one, two. Hey guys, welcome.